Hello then guys and welcome to another episode of the Greenway Farm Let's Play. So today, as you can tell, we're going to be doing uh, the silage bales uh, and we're going to be carting the hay and probably some silage bales, I'm not quite sure yet. Um, I know we're certainly going to um, be carting a load of of um, silage bears because until they're three days old they're, they're still grass um, in the seasons mod um, so um, I thought we'd get the grass that we'll need for our cows at some, that we'll need at some point for our cows um, so I thought we'd do that now before they, they turn into, into uh, silage and make use of that um side of things i i mean i probably don't need much but i'll just take a load and then what we don't use can just go in that uh, area with the back there with the other with the other bales um that we took off the uh cafe last cut i think as well put them so this is the last field of um the silage bales pretty good yield it's three stage fertilized um, if I remember correctly this is the same day that it was moaning so it's pretty good yield we're, we're getting up as so you can see we're getting a bale um, just before it's finished wrapped so that's that's very good really um, so yeah I said before they're in green so we know which ones are for to be sold. Uh, still going to stack them up because um, this is a three day thing and uh, I want to get some fertilizer out on this field before um, as soon as we can really. So might not stack them all, I might just leave some, some of the fields for, for the three days um, and then and then take them straight straight away sort of thing um, but but for the most part I intend to stack them obviously we've got uh, uh, the hay to stack as well yeah high yielding it does take a long time but uh, can't complain because you get more money from it so Good stuff. I think we'll probably say do the headlands of this and then we'll put a time lapse in because this this will take a fairly long time with the uh, um, stopping all the time. Disadvantage around Baylor but if you're doing silage bales with a square bailey, you, you're gonna have to uh, have a separate um, wrapper. So there's no real, no real advantage when it comes to silage bales. not quite sure when seasons puts its growth stages in when it comes to the autumn and that so whether we don't get any growth stages now till um till uh spring or what i don't know whether it just takes a bit longer or what i don't know really um this is my first well, for it would be first season um doing it so so we'll see uh, i mean in real life you, you'd expect a bit of growth on uh your, your winter winter crops um before winter really um probably the equivalent of one growth stage in the game we'll just get that bit um, unfortunately it wasn't quite made to get to the end 
Didn't quite make it to the end. Ooh. So yeah, this I have already done the other fields. Um, I need mean, they're very similar to this really in terms of in terms of how they're performing. Um, so hopefully we should get a fair bit of money. I'm not quite sure what they fetch silage bales, um, but I remember an extort they were an extortionate amount um, when we were doing the Brompton Let's Plates. We made a little fair bit of money um, when we did that for a couple of cuts. I think. Uh, a couple of you know sort of seasons we did that for and got a fair bit so it should be should be a good uh, way to to make some money we'll go back over there really don't need all of this so there's no, there's no point in keeping it all so that it's not in the way when you get to the runs he says and then it rolls oh forgot about the next bail oh well Should have probably put um, bail counter on really just for curiosity, but I don't think it really affects it too much. So there it is, card glitchy that bail counter it resets every time you you uh, reload your game. So it's uh, not ideal. So as you may or may not have gathered, um, I I've filmed these ahead of time. Um, I can't remember which episode number I just released, but um, I think there was something like two episodes ahead or something like that. Um, and just so you know, if I don't, if I don't get a chance to record, I've always got a bit of a safe um you know like something to fall back on so hopefully um that should allow me to every wednesday at four o'clock to put up a new episode now i would like to be on the two videos a week really but i don't want to set myself that goal because i don't want to be um saying that and then not being able to do it so i think I think we're gonna go with that um, for now, at least. Um, so hopefully, you should, you know, then be able to know when it's gonna come out and expect know know what you're expecting, sort of thing. Um, which, from what I can gather, um, quite helps with uh, views and all on how the how the reaction is to the uh, episodes. Um, so, yeah. This tractor could do with a bit of a wash, but we'll do it after the bailing it doesn't really matter I've got to get this done because the weather doesn't look great for the next few days this needs doing before it uh, 
go is a bit uh, bad weather. said before these as long as we can get the hay in today um the the savage bears can stay outside um it won't affect them really i uh, just want to get them cleared off as soon as we can to, to put some new fertilizer down um before it grows on because i said before i don't really know when it grows on when it comes to autumn because normally it's every three days but um I'm not sure for this. Anyway then guys, um I think we'll uh cut to um a time lapse for a bit, so I'll uh, see you guys in a minute. So as you can tell, we've uh, just finished that. Um, so I shall um, head back to the yard now, and we'll pick up the um, New Holland. And uh, we'll go cut some bears. Um, I have as you can see already stacked one field's worth um, that was just a, a large um, trailer's load I think we'll just pop it down probably about here and it's uh, no we'll just in case we need to come through I'll put it down here in case say in case we need to come through save the hassle later Might I think actually we'll go and do the um take a load of silage bears first of all. Um so yeah. As uh I will get a uh silage for a silage bail grab um but just as these are about to be fed I'm gonna use uh, the forks it's much easier um so yeah as we're gonna load up again in a minute I think we'll uh put on a go back to the time lapse I'll see you guys in a minute So we'll just pop this in. I don't really know how many they'll take. Uh, not very many, I wouldn't expect. But as I said before, we're going to shove them with the uh, 
the storage bales in there. Uh, we'll probably just keep them if, if we're shoving them in there. Um, saves properly stacking them. I don't really want to do that yet. Um, I'd rather crack on with the hay. Um, and I don't really care how they're stacked in there. They're just singles sort of thrown in. Um, yeah. I think I doubt they're going to take both of these, but we'll see. Or any by the look of it. Okay. Uh, right, in that case then, we'll start shoving them in there. Yeah, as I said before, I'm just gonna chuck them in. These really are rough. I could perhaps have done with putting the trailer in a slightly different place, but I won't. Let's go for the back of the trailer first because the others will probably clip each other and pull themselves off. Alright, um, so you can vaguely see from here the uh, hay I've decided to stack on the ends in front um, just because um, I could have stacked them um, normally uh, but I was thinking uh, I want them in front really because I want to use up the old ones first um, so uh, yeah, I put them on their uh, ends because that way they're not going to roll back, get pushed so easily, that sort of thing. So, um, and I'm not putting them very wide, so you can get around the side of them uh, in order to get through. We're gonna be all right. Oh no, that wasn't the plan. This is what I was on about earlier. I should have taken them back again, really, but there we go. It's because there's no cows in it, they don't actually, they don't know how much, because the amount that they accept varies with, um, varies as uh, the cows increase, and so um, it can't, it doesn't know how much to accept, so it's just a very minimum, uh, very minimal even, amount. Um, but it's better than nothing. Um, I don't really make grass bales with seasons. They um, they rot very quickly. Um, so there's no real point making them. Um, but I mean if, you, if you've got some a wagon or something. Then you can zero graze. Um, but uh, from my experience. You, you can get a limited amount of grass. Um, by pushing up. Whenever you push them up. 
um, that will give you some grass uh, however not really enough um, but you know it does give them something all the time but it, it it's constantly on very little uh, very low numbers anyway but uh, so I'll keep doing that whenever I uh, make silage bales I think um, obviously can't do now um, because I don't have um, any more cows so they are now full but um, I will be obviously be getting some once uh, we sold these so we're going to get the hay um, from I think it's still in field 4 I think I did the one behind the contract it's not field 4 obviously as you can see all these two, fit, two here are um, bailed so they'll all have to come in um, given that we've just done some silage bales and uh, some uh, hay bales what I'll perhaps do um, is maybe I'll stick a short time lapse of uh, using uh, a, the silage bale grab which we'll have to buy in a minute um, I'll probably make a time lapse of using that at the beginning of the next um, episode. So I think that's our best way. Yeah, I'm just going to go for the in-game one. Um, there is. Um, the McHale um, one that has got the tubes and slots underneath um, which is the most common sort uh, but I find they're quite glitchy for FS so I'll uh, be getting the um, side pins one um, instead I think quite sure how long this episode will actually be because it's got two time lapses in it so I don't think I think it's only actually going to be around the well, you'll probably be screaming at your screen right now but I'm going to guess it's probably around the 20 minute mark at this minute roughly just depends how fast I make the uh, time lapse comment below whether you, whether you like the idea of the time lapses it was suggested to me in one of the episodes I think or or someone I was talking to or something like that um, to do that um, and I think it probably is a good idea when you're doing jobs that you know there's plenty of um, but you're not necessarily got enough to talk about in it and it just gets a bit boring if I'm stu um, just working away in silence so I think that's that's probably probably going to be a good approach. But if you guys don't want it, I can cut that those scenes out and just do um, just go straight to the next task or or whatever. Um, tell me what you want. I was thinking perhaps uh, we'll get different fields um, that we get our straw from um, 
this next season. Um, I think that probably probably might be a good idea um, because those two smaller fields seem, you know, they're a bit more difficult to get to. But I'll speak to the contractor, um, see what they they reckon, and then when it comes to it, um, next harvest we'll just get which, whichever fields uh, we're given in a way because we'll just ask for a rough area rather than uh, rather than specific fields necessarily I'd rather have a bit more and go into the and make it last to the next season sort of thing uh, rather than not have enough and have to buy it in um, but as we say this season uh, we probably well I'm almost certain we'll have um, some left over because we don't actually own any cows yet so we're not you know we're not starting needing straw straight from the off um, like we uh, expect to be doing in um, in uh, seasons to come on this side now, I'll pop this on top I did want to be the other side ready but I won't hey ho that's not an ideal but it'll do grab that too should work they're pretty close together if we can get a better angle might be alright there we go I think that will I'll do, it's hanging off slightly but I don't really dare push it because it will probably pull the others off so I think that's the best plan. Ooh, that was a bit fast. Oh well. If it's on, it's on. How are we looking? We have to do another load, don't we? So tell you what then guys, I'll leave this bit here and uh I'll come back when we're um stuck in the end of the next uh, when we're stuck in the next load um.
Alright you guys, so about now we're just putting on the final bail as you can see. Um as you saw from the time lapse there, um I decided to try and rather badly put the um a top layer on just because I decided I want to keep the baler in here really. Um so yeah, I was just trying to make a bit extra space so it didn't come so far forward. Um, did probably didn't need to put just all of them on. Could have taken two off the bat there, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, they're on. Um, not the neatest as I say, but uh, again, they're in a stack. Stacks are for me keeping uh, space usage down. So it achieves that goal. And uh, I'll leave this. Let's put this in here for the minute. We don't. We will need it. So I'll. Uh, even though it's blocking it in a bit, but uh, we will need it in a minute. Well, not in a minute, but uh, soon. Uh, so yeah. Oh, hold on. Which one is it on? There we go. Right. So we'll. Uh, just purchase and uh, collect our bail grab um, this is one we're going to be going for um, yeah I, I don't think I think I think that will do our job um, let's leave it in black that's fine not to be adding any cost to it because uh, money's a bit thin on the ground So yeah. As I say, said before, we'll uh, I'll do a little time lapse at the beginning of the next episode of uh, carting and stacking a load or something of, of uh, those salish bales, um, and then I'm not quite sure what we're doing you know, so, so possibly fertilising. Um, don't really want to be doing um, too. I don't really want to be doing too much of that because I've been doing a lot of that recently, and uh, probably get a bit boring. Um, so we'll see if I can think of anything else. Then I'll mean, probably be on that, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. suppose we'll get a bail on the way past, I don't know really, we may as well. As we're going past. And it does, will make it slightly awkward uh, being this way up but as I say, and as far as I know, those roll types are glitchy. So I think this is what we're just going to have to go with. But then, you know, I th again, this this can be glitchy. Um, bail physics aren't, as we all know ideal in this game so yeah it's definitely glitching but uh, it should be enough to get them to the trailer and onto the stack so this here for the minute um, 
So yes then guys, uh, thank you very much for watching um, and I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to smash that uh, subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. See you in the next one. Bye.